What's going on everybody? Brian here. Now, about a week or two ago, the digitizer on my phone stopped working, so I was sent a new front panel that included the glass digitizer and the LCD display. Um, I was actually going to make a video showing the entire teardown process, but um, I was actually waiting on my new home button to arrive, and I just received it today, and I was hoping that it would have shown up last Wednesday, but the seller on eBay shipped it five days after I bought it, which was very disappointing. So it just showed up today, and so in this video I'm going to show you the teardown process. It's going to be, you know, sped up like four times faster. Um, I could actually take this thing apart and put it back together very quickly because half the screws are missing and some of the other things inside are missing as well so it makes the teardown process a lot quicker and basically I ordered a new home button along with my new front panel because as you can see the home button is very dark compared to my screen so I have this new home button and it looks much much better so the results should be pretty good so let's go ahead and get this going
Alright, so it looks like everything was installed just fine. As you can see, the home button works fine. The screen continue, continues to work perfectly as well. So the new home button, as you can see, is much wider than it was before. Here is the old home button. Big difference in the shade of white. Now I do have a screen protector installed, so that's what's making my screen look fairly dark. So I'm actually going to just take this off. I didn't do a good alignment anyway. And there you go. Really nice looking white iPhone 4. So there you go. If you have any comments, questions, or suggestions, you can leave them down below in the comments area. But that's about it. So thanks a lot for watching, and I'll talk to you guys soon.